Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and today video will be all about finances. And if you found yourself in a situation when you broke and don't know what to do, this reading might help you to improve your finances, okay? Uh, as usual, we will have uh, six piles, I think for this case we need six different piles, uh, represented by different cards. Let's pick uh, your card now, okay? Pick a card. Uh, just pick a card which will resonate with you. Medicine wheel. Okay. Number two. Wind. Okay. Wind of changes. Number three. The seer. And oh, in greenish hammer. Color, colors him green and brown or oh, something new the arrow okay the holy martin and okay it's gonna be seven different cards okay it, it won't have to be like this um flow number six and number seven Lightning. Okay, very, very interesting. We kind of went from greeny, uh, green brown colors here through violet red and brown to bluish and bit yellowish. Okay, uh, blue brown yellowish, then blue yellowish, and finally blue. Last one. Lightning. Okay, guys. So let's start your reading. Those who choose this medicine wheel. Okay, here will be very, very, very important messages for you. How can you now improve your finances? What you should do? What you shouldn't do? And what the hell is going on? Because this reading is for those who just right now feeling broke. Okay, like he or she is broke now. So how can you help your finances right now? What should you do? What you shouldn't do? Okay, what you should do? Take decision carefully. Think about all pluses, all minuses. Don't jump, just don't rush for any job, okay? I'm getting a strong message. What you shouldn't do? Again. Don't rush, don't jump, uh, kind of. It might seem to you that this last opportunity and last train um, and you need to jump this person. Don't do this. Think twice, think carefully about opportunities, fi financial opportunities you seen, okay? Mm, try to see all pluses, all minuses, kind of. And think about situation because there will be hidden some important hidden details from you. Uh, at the first sight it might seem to be very nice offer to improve your finances or very nice job or, or very nice project but in fact in fact there is a lot of lot of lot of hidden information so please guys be careful those who choose a medicine will what else which else messages here will be very special type of cards. Okay. Okay, which else messages for you? Which else advices on your finances? How can you improve your finances? You can improve first of all with taking careful decisions, thinking on each and every detail, uh, as well details of your spendings. Okay, because I, I I'm getting for you that money just uh, going through your fingers like a water. Okay. You should be optimistic uh, and you should um, uh, be ready to join collective because we, we have here horse drive. We have here horse drive card. Um, uh, you should be optimistic, you should show respect, um, you should be ready to take part in, in, in something. Um, but again, um, 
a uh, horse is you know such passionate power when horse runs especially somewhere um, in a rush you shouldn't rush blindly okay you shouldn't rush but you should be ready to act you should be ready to take decisions with this um horse tribe let's say what else for you you should stay optimistic but you shouldn't run blindly because you know some some horses they blindfold yeah <laughs> they blindfold you know some horses in in order not to to scare them and for you i'm getting a strong message that you might be afraid even to take part in, some, in something or apply for something you might feel scared some of you uh, it, it's two opposite behaviors here we have him okay some of you might be very scared as this blindfolded horse okay and some of you might be too too much wild horse so for you what should you do balance these energies okay you shouldn't be afraid you should stay optimistic shouldn't be afraid to take on new chances on new opportunities on new jobs okay to join new collective but uh, on the other hand, you shouldn't just rush there uh, so much, you know, rush without knowing any details, okay? What health message for you? Yeah, shyness. Shyness. Yeah, for some of you, shyness. Shyness and, uh, again, this uh, choleric temper. For some of you, shyness and, and choleric temper. You see this fairy, fairy upside down, a uh, fairy upside down, um, and again we dealing with two opposite qualities which you should um, learn how to balance. Okay, some of you might be very shy, some of you might be um, this choleric temper, not not that shy, but taking fast and not smart decisions. Okay, and some of you are too shy. Um, and some of you have both sides of this when they act this and that, uh, which they must balance, okay? So, for those of you who are shy, you should um, act, um, you know, more confident, okay? For those of you who have this choleric temper, you shouldn't uh, take... Um, fast decisions you should think about uh, decision uh, you're taking uh, yeah <laughs> again very interesting messages okay and one more I, I'm gonna get from other pile from other deck sorry yeah <laughs> decision again <laughs> you should learn to balance okay some of you are rushing too much in decisions they not thinking at all what they're taking on okay and some of you too much like uh, this hangman energy when you just hang somewhere and you lost Please, please, guys, um, take these decisions wisely, okay? Please, uh, this indecision energy, learn balance, okay? Strong message here, because some of you like this, some of you totally opposite. And some of you act sometimes like this and sometimes like that, and that's a chaotic mess. So you should learn balance, energy number eight, you should learn balance, okay? Medicine will... I hope you understood your message. Uh, please leave me a comment. How does it resonate? And if you want to get more readings, subscribe. Okay, guys, we move into this beautiful wind card. Um, let's see how can you improve your finances. Okay, guys, how can you improve your finances here? How can you improve your finances? Let's take a look. What should you do to improve your finances? Okay, page of wands we have. And what you shouldn't do? 
um, we got here judgment okay <laughs> um, guys please be persistent uh, what I'm getting what should you do um, uh, majority of you who choose this card you just like wind of changes today you like and I gonna do this and tomorrow I gonna focus on that and when nothing is going right just because you try this try that and gave up uh, you love to complain oh, kind of you love to complain why it didn't work for me why this business project didn't work for me uh, why I didn't earn their themselves uh, that much as another person earned so you very passionate at the beginning uh, but very fast you just lose lose your interest and start complaining looking around and start com complaining please uh, stop complaining uh, and um, be persistent about what you're doing not like this one one night lover okay when today you you in love with your new job um, and tomorrow you don't like this one you don't like that one you you don't like how they treat you you don't like your duties you don't like this that that and, and finally decides on second day that this job not for you and bye bye and i will be searching another one so please work on this okay guys uh which else message which else message here for you advice how can you improve your finances okay <laughs> bad card <laughs> and again it, it you very emotional um you should be more rational okay uh, more persistent and you should be responsible responsible i'm getting here strong responsibility a responsibility vibe it says you stop being uh, emotional start being rational uh, and responsible so this way and only you're gonna improve your finances the bet deliver your your message okay okay video keep video just keep freezing so, so they're very interesting <laughs> and we have here frog <laughs> a frog okay by yourself you know this three three pounds frog with a coin in the mouth uh, well give it a try give this frog a try and let this frog to remind you okay uh, stay focused okay uh, every time you look at this frog with coin in her um, mouth just remember you should you should shut up complaining about your life you should shut up and work persistently on your money okay you should focus you shouldn't be too much emotional buy yourself a frog this frog with three percent coin as a reminder you know such feng shui so winner it will help you okay despite how much crazy it sounds but it's gonna help you okay frog frog and bed very nice companions here okay what else what else door to personal healing and happiness yeah finally you will open you should heal your um emotions i'm getting because you're too much emotional passionate about whatever you start doing but uh then next day like uh no interest at all okay uh, okay guys now we are moving to the card number three the seer how can you improve your finances how could you improve your finances guys what should you do what you shouldn't do first messages we will get what you should do then what you shouldn't do to improve your finances okay and just general advice is what you should do you should find yourself sources of passive income some of you maybe go to property business 
Das ist zwei beim Gellen hier. What you shouldn't do, nine of cups. Again, uh, here, what you should do, you should start, uh, should build within yourself a habit of investment, a habit of saving money. What you shouldn't do, you shouldn't just uh, fly in the clouds, dreaming of your all wishes come true, because some people, they, you know, they're using this transferring of uh, reality, visualizations and everything, and... Uh, but they do nothing to plant a habit of prosperous person and simply saving at least one percent of your income will plant this habit will plant this ability that you will be able to save ten percent as they recommend at least start with one percent of your income whatever you have um getting a strong message just uh, stop dreaming start acting okay stop dreaming start acting stop dreaming to of being a king start acting like a king if you want to be rich at least start saving one percent you can't say one percent then save save kind of uh, zero point one percent from all your income uh, but it should be exact uh, amount, exact number, exact percentage every every month, and then raise it slowly. But with this simple action, you will plan, plan, plan future seeds of future success. Okay, and learn about investment, learn about some property business, learn something about property. I'm getting strong vibe here, guys. Okay, what else? But for most of you, you know, you might be buying all talismans, all money amulets, doing all these visualizations, energy cleansing, uh, attracting money, uh, meditations. Stop this shit. <laughs> you know, start delivering small but habits of prosperous person, okay? Start do something in 3D for, for, for this, because... Or what you're doing, it's in 5D, okay? It, it has nothing to do with, with money or with the reality you live in, okay, guys? Okay. Hope this message wasn't too hurtful for you, my dear seers, uh, I'm guessing. Yeah, and that's why seer card. <laughs> so stop dreaming, start acting. <laughs> because, you know, you, you might be doing a lot of this... Um, Kind of visualization job on your finances meditation job but no results because you're doing wrong things now what you should do is you start you should start developing real habits let it be small but growing okay fight your stereotypes conflict with past yes it's totally new life for you if you used to attract money through meditations it won't work anymore okay it's not working already yeah you you should give up on what's not serving you and all these meditations all this crap it's not serving you right now okay you overdid all this stuff okay it's too much of this and that's why this Panic thrivers because you kind of, um, you kind of still not wanna die and reborn. You 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 still have hope that this your uh, simple meditation for direct abundance will work without real actions. And here you see, kind of compass vibe. Uh, you need to correct your plans according to circumstances. Okay. And you might have some obstacles which you should wait. They they will pass. You should you should wait. Just just at some point of you should do nothing. Just wait a little bit for some obstacles y you will be facing. Okay, on your way of changes, on your way of changes of financial mindset whatever you have now you should reborn you should develop within yourself totally new uh, financial mindset okay and correct your plans because maybe you you plan that you will be buying lottery every sunday and doing uh, money um 
attract money meditation and you will you gonna win million uh, at one of Sundays some, something like this no guys <laughs> you're on just correct your plans okay yeah you're losing possibilities okay you're losing possibilities doing this what you're doing now okay whatever whatever you do now all this uh, mostly you're doing like in your head doing zero in reality um still hoping still with this phoenix bird drivers you're still hoping that it, it might work but you're losing chances you keep losing chances to improve your finance in other ways because there are more but you focus you just see one way which you stick to and for majority of you I, I told you what kind of way it is it's just sitting still doing all this meditation visualization and everything and doing zero in real you keep losing on opportunities to improve your finances just because you don't want to change your mindset okay start develop uh, your strong message start develop habits of rich people okay okay guys i hope you all like your reading please let me know in comments how does it resonate and hit, sub hit subscribe button if you want to see more <laughs> okay and we're moving forward to this arrow card how dear arrows how can you improve your finances if you're broke right now what should you do what you shouldn't do okay let's take a look your energies what you should do what you shouldn't do should do what you shouldn't do should do oh ace of swords ace of swords you should do you should cut past what you shouldn't do you shouldn't hesitate okay you shouldn't hesitate uh, telling oh i have a not enough knowledge i have a not enough skills here strong vibe of own business of opening starting something new something on your own okay mm, something connected with uh information info business here i'm getting strong vibe of info business so um stop searching for excuses why you can't run on business run it okay and it's gonna be something uh, info business i'm getting strong vibe here for info business Nice. Should do what you shouldn't do. And which else advices will pull for you? Pay attention to the little details and um, become responsible, this card says to you. Okay? You should become responsible. This is a uh, horse tribe, but drivers we have here card, and it says you is pointing out why you, why you still not starting your own business, but you should because still you don't want to take this responsibility. You don't want to to pay attention to little details. Uh, or, or control people who will be doing this job. You know, paying attention to these little details. So it's time to learn responsibility for you. Butterfly. Butterfly. Collaboration and critics. Ability to listen and to hear. A desire to make agreements, diplomacy, feedback. Very nice, very, very nice card. Yeah, as I said, you some info business some info business on diplomacy here mm, ab ability to make an agreements ability to listen and to hear okay yeah something with info business for sure here with this butterfly card so should to improve your finances try to own info business all tied up <laughs> again you keep such an excuses but you got this swords here to to cut this cut this rope but you pretend as you're not seeing this swords around you that you don't know that you have all the tools to to start on business you keep pretend 
to be a victim uh, and to dump responsibility on someone else that's why you so much scared and afraid to, to start on business but this is exactly what will help you to improve your finances on business responsibility and attention to details ability to see details okay guys i hope you like your reading please let me know how does it resonate with you uh if you want to get more spiritual messages hit subscribe button okay stay with me and now we're moving to those who choose this holy mountain card and so we will see what you should do to improve your finances what you shouldn't do to improve your finances which advice is from spirit which advice is spirit have for you okay what you should do what you shouldn't do holy mountain what you should do the star you should work with your talent because you have strong those who choose this card you have strong beliefs that you can't earn money with art you you can't you know you can't earn money with talent you can't monetize your talent or your hobby you're not seeing chances you should grab on chance okay because they they you kind of you keep rejected you're not seeing your gift you're not seeing you're so stubborn you're not seeing your talent the universe gave you this cup and say use it use it to shine but you keep refusing this gift you're not using it you're giving up you're going into some directions which are not not for you at all you gave up on your talent guys that strong vibe you're not seeing even some of you even not seeing your talent but you're incredibly talented so it's time to start noticing your talent okay what you should do you should develop your own talent what you should stop doing you should stop doubting yourself stop rejecting kind of some of you might oh i'm not special my paintings are not special or my voice not special my songs not special my poems not special and so on so on that no one needs it stop doing this to yourself okay what else we have for here you see the shell you afraid you so much freaking afraid to go out of your shell and shine your talent to the world guys evolution you should evolution should happen to you and to your talent and then a totally unexpected results on its way and fame yeah and fame and you will be getting this card says you will be getting very nice opportunities and this card again you're not seeing opportunities but you get in them and you will keep getting them just come out of your shell to grab on these opportunities which are life-changing yeah you should you should change your here we have this stork tribe reversed you should uh, change your Okay, I'm getting a certain message to someone constantly getting you out of your um, of your stream of luck, okay? Uh, for example, how it might happen, someone might say you, Hey George, there is a nice job there, there, and I earn that much, do you wanna try? Um, and you kind of seeing uh, how other person earning such nice money and you just grab and, uh, this opportunity mm. even you it's not it's not it has nothing to do with your talent you you don't like to do this but you're just seduced by that this person was able to earn there you seduced by money and then you grab on this nothing going well because you're not using your talent you you in totally different shit uh, lead it by different person um and uh, kind of yeah this misinformation disinformation going on here this disinformation um under influence of this kind of disinformation you're changing your initial plans on, on developing your talent and you're getting out of your stream of luck you're getting hit out and then you're asking yourself what i'm what i'm ever doing here why did i i was so stupid that i read for this guys 
magician of the mirror again again you have all the tools you have your talent it's time to believe in yourself it's time to believe in yourself because your future is gonna be magical if you believe in, in yourself in your talent and start working on it okay not chasing money but chasing your talent developing it and then money start coming towards you just in a magical way if you cope with this um always this strong you know mindset that uh, uh, no one needs your talent no one needs your art no one needs your whatever just get this out of your head and you will see how your reality will change okay and if you like your reading please leave me comment uh, if you want to get more readings hit subscribe button and I hope to see you really soon in my next videos now we move into those who choose this flow card and we will see what should you do what you shouldn't do to improve your finances okay what you should do what you shouldn't do to improve your finances and some advices for you from spirit so what you should do what you flow card what you shouldn't do with your finances if you're broke right now okay the death transformation change profession it says to you transformation you hang into some 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 something old it says you uh, welcome these changes instead of hiding and afraid of them and open your potential uh, what you not uh, what you not doing you're not opening your potential your full potential you afraid of these changes you should welcome these changes into your life okay not afraid of them because these changes they will serve uh, your in the best way uh, opening up your full potential okay opening your talent to the world okay guys so why i'm getting some of you should do uh, floristic <laughs> some of you maybe should try themselves in this garden and in floristics here rose you see on her flag on this flag and here you you can see a lot of flowers around his neck okay lion's neck <laughs> florists very interesting energies guys just very interesting okay and you resisting this you you should stop resisting because this is lion he is resistant you should stop resisting changes you should welcome them with arms wide open okay what else we have here fountain fountain of creative ideas uh, of easy first creative steps inspiration love which moves mountain mountains this fountain beautiful fountain card definitely you, you are avoiding to to do what you love to do you resist changes what else progress <laughs> ah, we had this in one of previous piles this frog card but it's reversed uh, for them ad advice was different bit different y you you can check some uh, of the advices with rope for you for you it will be different um, stop being ready start practicing generosity stop being ready you ready you're not letting go of old things of old stuff in your house it's time to share and care okay stop being ready <laughs> yeah okay guys one more message for you yeah flow don't resist this flow this powerful water strategy but of course you should have a plan as well plan learn to plan your 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 future yeah and adjust your plan accordingly to to the events in your life okay yeah here i'm getting yeah that kind of you used to to that everything this way and you so much afraid of changes afraid of change of plan no dear viewers you should you should learn this how to you should learn this uh, skill of ability to to change plans okay to adjust plans okay because it's 
yeah, change, change in plans, okay? Oh, guys, I hope you like your message. I hope, really hope it was helpful. Uh, let me know, please, in comments below. Uh, and if you want to get more spiritual advices, hit subscribe button and I will see you in my next readings, okay? And last one, not least, card number seven, which just uh, I thought I will be doing just uh, six different spreads, but here's a card number seven pop up. So I think those who choose these cards are really special people. And uh, I feel like I need to deliver extra message for you guys. So one more, one more we're going. What you should do, what you shouldn't do to improve your finances. Some, some advices from spirit. do <laughs> five of wands a fight for your place on the sun why oh, I'm getting this message fight shouldn't do moon you shouldn't rely on 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 just good luck or um, yeah yeah you shouldn't be afraid fears fears Cope with your fears. What you shouldn't do, you shouldn't allow your fears conquer you. Okay, go face your fears. Yeah, this strong message from spirit. Face your fears. Fight your fears. Okay, get rid of your fears. Yeah, that's a strong message here. Really, you have a lot of fears. Those who choose these cards. Okay, you have so many fears. Face them all. Face them all. Fight them. Okay. Fight these fears, okay? Fight for your place under the moon and stars and sun, okay? What else? What else? Which else card we have? Gonna have here? Okay. Yeah, bad but reversed. Again, bad reversed. It's a lot of uh, fears. You live in um, captured, you know. You live in imprisoned by stereotypes, okay? Or different taboos, and you going backwards in your uh, career because of this. Even backwards, you move in. Even moving backwards, for example, if you had a uh, top management post, now you just. In your career just regular managers just everything because of your fears so cope with your fears guys work with your fears and mirror reverse too much criticism you criticizing too much external world and as well you criticizing at point you criticizing yourself deep down but what you show outside you kind of prideful too prideful of yourself kind of but this outside you're showing uh, inside you criticizing yourself even more than you criticizing people around and you're not able to let go of the past and past 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 and stereotypes it slows you down more and more in your career so that's why backwards i'm telling you those who choose this card you you might even find yourself at stage where you I made a few steps backwards. Fifth chakra, Hebrew. It says, yeah, recognize your fears, speak out your fears, share, maybe share your fears with some therapist, okay, therapist, psychologist, life coach, as me. Uh, share your fears, speak them out, work with them. Just work with your fears and you will improve your finances okay guys i hope it resonated please let me know in comments how do you like your message uh okay uh and if you want to get more spiritual advices like this just hit subscribe button and let me know in comment what kind of financial reading you you might need in future uh okay and hope to see you really soon in my next videos bye bye